Hello everyone! I thought that I would do a little Zara try on today. I did a really huge order. A couple different orders but I'm gonna compress it into one video so let's just begin. So I am so ready for fall and this is all my pre-fall transitional stuff that I'm gonna be wearing and layering and every time fall comes around I always change up my little concept and for this fall it's gonna be very minimal. I feel like summer is always like you try to be creative because you're wearing less because it's hot and when the fall comes around you're layering i personally just love to tone it down be more minimal but me be more clean lines and more chic so that's kind of what this try on is about i'm trying to not use the word haul anymore so i'm trying to you know figure out some other words basically it's just a big mix of stuff so starting off with this top right here so i talked about this showed this on my tiktok you guys went crazy over it i got it in all three colors it's a basic top with a wide ribbing right here it has this like curly hem at the neck and i just love this for basic so you know as much as i'm not trying to buy very you can tell it's from zara pieces i do love their basic pieces and with this it could go so well with so many different things i wore it to hawaii with some cute white shorts you could wear this under suiting for work you could wear it casually with pants the way i have it worn right here so i love this because there's so many uses for it so get it while they still have it and then like i said i got all three colors right here i got a size small it fits me great so people always ask me what bra i wear i just wear my normal strapless bra sometimes my bra shows sometimes it doesn't i feel like if you're gonna wear a white one wear a white bra if you're gonna wear a black one wear a black bra if you're gonna wear this color wear a nude bra and i feel like it works fine so this is definitely like a need for a basic and then these jeans they're called the marine this is definitely another need i think you need from zara so let me just move these little stools right here so you guys can see better but this is what the jeans look like they're like a little bit of a wide leg or a flare at the bottom but they're really high waisted and they cinch your waist around here really nicely and they're not too long so if you're taller this would work really well with boots so i just love like the silhouette it gives your body a really nice shape and then you can throw on your boots on your knees or your heels and it'll just give a really nice like type of shape i don't know if you guys understand what i'm talking about but this is what the back looks like for this one i size up i get a size two it fits me really comfortably and these are actually more on the comfortable side when it comes to Zara jeans. They're soft and they're stretchy and they're so, so flattering. So I loved these ones so much that I ended up getting the black leather version. All right, so these are the black leather marine pants. So these are the exact same ones that I was just wearing just in black leather. So again, I love the silhouette so much, especially for my body type. It's super flattering and it flares out just so nicely that you can wear anything, heels, sneakers, boots underneath it. I got these like pointy toe silver Prada mules and I just easily wanted to wear it this way. So this is also a new little cropped tee with a little pocket right here that I got for the fall transition. Like I said, I would just pair like a chunky necklace over this top and that would be a really cute, simple, minimal, but yet like cool type of outfit. So I really do love this boxy crop t-shirt. I even love the length of the sleeve. So I did get it in this like icy gray color. I envision myself wearing this with a chunky necklace and some gray trousers, like pleated trousers that are coming in pretty soon, but any gray trouser will do. I just love that look again that I could pair with sneakers or boots or heels. So yeah. Thought I'd get this gray color. I barely have any gray, but I feel like for the fall time, this could be really, really cute. All right, and then here's a top or corset top from Zara, obviously, that did not work, but I thought I'd still show you guys in case, you know, you may have the body type better for it. I thought this was really, really cute regardless, though. Unfortunately, there's just too much of a gap, like, here between my boob and the top, I guess. So this is a corset top. It's kind of like a champagne color i really wanted this to work with pants jeans trousers whatever and possibly like a blazer over 
over the top. I try to pair over the top and underneath together. So overneath was the word anyway. So this just did not work. Like I said, too much of a gap, but I feel like if you had, you know, bigger boobs, this might be really, really cute. So yeah, this will be going back. All right, so here again is another basic piece that I really loved. It looks like a halter top, a very indented like sleeve right here, I guess. I don't know how to call it, but I really loved just like the shape of it. Again, you could use this for layering, throw like a bomber jacket over it or a blazer, what have you. I really love the material, it's super thin, but it's not like a thin like cotton. It's a very, it's a nicer than cotton type of material. And then these jeans I also got from Zara. These are called like the boyfriend jean from Zara. They are a full length. I did cuff them at the bottom. I tried to cuff them as thin as I could because I don't like folding my jeans up, but I guess for the baggy look, it's okay. The only issue is that it is a little big around the waist. It is a boyfriend jean, so I think essentially a boyfriend jean is supposed to fit it looser anyway, so I'm still not sure if I'm gonna keep them. I did check and the smallest size they did have was a size two. They don't have a zero in this, but they do have like a darker version of this that does have a zero, but the zero is sold out. So I'm like waiting for it to appear again. Hopefully it does. This is just like the way that I'm wearing it. Again, I paired it with my pointy toe Pradas and then I'll show you guys on one leg what the full length looks like. Okay, never mind. I'll show you on both legs what the full length looks like right here. So I don't know, it might just be a little bit too long. I'm not so sure. What do you guys think? Cuffed or full length? Return them, keep them? Not quite sold. All right, so here is a shoulder padded t-shirt that I really loved. I did think that it was black and white stripes, but it's actually navy, navy and white stripes. So I really love this. Might get it in black as well. I got a size small. It fits, you know, pretty good. This is supposed to be an oversized tee. I did tuck it into these pants that these are culotte. So basically they're pretty similar to the marine jean and pant that I just showed you. However, these are like your classic culotte pants. The issue is that it is a little bit big. This is a size zero, but it's still big. I also think my weight's just fluctuating a little bit. So I just loved the crepey material of these pants so that I have options between a leather and a normal black, you know, pant. But I'm not sure how flattering it is around here because it is on the looser side. So I might return them. This is what they look like. I might return them because I think I might just be good with one culotte style pant. Maybe I don't need these ones. But in case, you know, you guys did like a not leather look and you still like that like wide leg cropped style, I just wanted to show you this anyway. I really, really loved how it looked on the model. Just wish it wasn't so loose. So don't think there's anything they can do about this. And I think this will be going back. Okay, so next up we have this like mesh t-shirt. So I actually have this in a tank version. So this is the tank version and I loved it so much. So I decided to try the t-shirt version of it. It is sheer, so you kind of have to be okay with that or use like a white tank underneath. I think that would be cute too or even just like a white bandeau top or something. So this is really cute. I think paired with jeans would be really cute. I did get this skirt that I am going to return just cause I don't know, the quality of it is not what I wanted. I wanted a little bit more. So this is just like a ribbed midi skirt. It fits really well. However, I think if you're gonna wear this more for casual looks, it's fine, but if you wanted to make it a little more, I don't even know how to say it, but you guys know what I mean. Like if you wanted it to be a little more there with the structure and the material, I don't think you're gonna love this, but again, more casually, I think this is fine. And they also had, I think, a black version, but this is a cute outfit. All right, so here is a really cute sweater that I absolutely love. It's like an oversized pink sweater that I personally would wear as a dress. Well, this is obviously from Zara. And then I got some platform boots that are going back, but I thought I'd show you guys anyway, in case you guys are interested in them. And of course, you guys don't worry, everything will be linked 
in the description box below. But I feel like for my size, these boots were just a little bit much. I think that if they were just not as chunky, they would work fine. For me, being petite, I would wear these boots with dresses and shorter things like this to make it look cute. Otherwise, I think it just kind of eats me up a little bit. But I wanted to show them to you guys anyway so that you guys can decide if you want them or not. And they did come in a really pretty like cognac brown color, which I wish I got just to try. I also wanted to show you guys some really cool rings. These are from Zara and they come in a set and they're square. I love that this is like silver and gold and then this one's gold because I'm really into silver right now, but I of course love gold, so. All right, so I did get another pair of heels that I wanted to show you guys that I thought were so cute right here. So this is just a simple pair of gold heels. Let me see if I can move the camera, get a better view. Okay, so these are the gold heels. They're kind of like a lace-up, but a little more minimal, and they do have like a little, what do you call this, like clasp that you can, instead of like tying it in a knot, it actually does have like a clasp or a lock or whatever you want to call it. Sorry, I saw the tags on everything, but yeah, I didn't have a real like heel that was gold that was just simple and I thought I needed it. So I got these ones and I think they're pretty cute. And the heel on these, they're not too high. All right, you guys. So again, I will link everything in the description box. So be sure to check that out. I'm on my phone right now because I'm going to share with you guys two things I have in my cart currently. So the first is this pleated short skirt limited edition. It's like a pleated skirt. No, it's not a skirt. It's a skirt, but it's a short skirt. So we have to see what that means. I'm petite. So a lot of times I need it shorter. And then this black bomber jacket right here. And you can see she's wearing it with that same skirt. So I think that could be a really cute outfit, especially with like knee high boots. And yeah, that's in my cart currently. So I will link those two as well. And anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. See you in my next video.